it's Tara here with an update for you guys. If you've been following along, you would know that I started a new kind of video series a few weeks back talking about regain and what I was going to do to try to tackle getting some of the regain off. I've got about 40 pounds of regain. When I had my uh, surgery, I started out at my highest weight was 200, sorry, 252 pounds. Surgery day, I weighed 235, I got down to 172, and I'm back up now into the two, two teens. It, it varies every day, um, but I'm back up into the, into the 213, somewhere right around there, two, six, between 213 and 216, a lot of times more in the 215 and 216. So um, I was struggling and decided it's time to get back on track. So I've got some good news and some bad news. Um, the good news is that I have really ramped up my fitness, my exercise regimen. That's huge for me. Um, the more I do it, the more I want to do it. And it just keeps kind of steamrolling and gaining that momentum. And that's very, very helpful for me. The bad news is that after all this time of doing that, I haven't lost a pound, not one. It, like I said, it fluctuates in that range, but I'm not, not losing anything. So I know from experience working out, you gain muscle, you don't necessarily lose weight, but when you're at the weight that I am, when you're in that 200s and, and I'm doing the kind of activity that I am, you would expect to see some, some weight loss. So I am starting to refocus on my, my nutrition, I'm not necessarily tracking specific macros yet. One step at a time is kind of my, my philosophy. So I'm really just trying to pay more attention to what I'm eating, the quality of the food that I'm eating. Quantity isn't really an issue for me. Still have that restriction from surgery. I still can't eat a lot at one time, but I can eat a lot over a long time. I can eat and then a half an hour later go eat a little bit more and a little bit more and a little bit more. Grazing, we all know how bad that is. So trying to really just pay attention to the basics. Um, one little thing at a time, like I said. So that's, uh, that's where I'm at right now. Um, I just finished a 30 minute Peloton bike ride. That's why I'm all hot, sweaty, gross looking and I'm getting ready to do a 20 minute strength workout. Um, my husband just left to go get his hair cut so and he voted this morning so I am all alone so I'm taking advantage of my Saturday morning to get it all to get it all done. Um, my bike ride this morning I hit a new personal record, a personal personal best and also hit a goal that I had set for myself which is a 200 output for a 30 minute class. The best I had ever done in the last five months since I got my bike was 187 and I hit 202 today so I was really very pleased thrilled with that um, so, so it's a good morning so that's really all that's going on with me I'm still here I'm still trying to get the the regain off still trying to figure out the puzzle put all the pieces together and see what's gonna work for me obviously what I've been doing is isn't working so I'm going to stay the course with my my workouts um, for those of you that have watched me before um, I've got a treadmill and I've got a bike and um, my bike and treadmill can cast to this TV that I use and you can see this is the class that I'm getting ready to do with Maddie Majacomo. Um love him to death he's so cute um, my workout space here on the on the floor so I'm getting ready to knock out this this 20 minute class and I'm still breathless from my ride but it was so good so oh and look look you guys I hate that I can't turn my screen around on iPhone it really stinks but look Cody Rigsby is my favorite Peloton instructor ever love him so much um, oops sorry and he did a series of classes called XOXO Cody. Um, it was basically like a back to school themed series of rides. It was, I think it was four rides um, at, when, school, when school started or should have started. 
Um, I got this in the mail the other day. You can see it's got the grades on it there. And anybody that finished all of his classes, I think they sent these out to everybody that finished all four of the classes. But he signed a hundred of them. One hundred out of God knows how many thousands of people did this. I got a signed copy of it. Ah! I was so excited. I wanted to cry. I couldn't even wait till I got out of my car to open my mail. So, yeah. I'm a dork. Anyway, that's all I've got for you guys. I just wanted to let you know that I'm still here. I'm still trying. I'm still plugging away at it. I'm not giving up. You don't give up either. I know there's a lot of us in this boat with this regain stuff. Do not give up. It is hard. They tell us that it's hard when we go into this and it's so easy in the beginning and you don't believe it. Then you get a couple years into it and it's like, oh crap, this is hard. This really is work. Now I've got to fix what I've done to myself. So I'm going to go get on this strength workout. I'm going to do it and I will check back in with you guys in a couple weeks and let you know where I'm at. Love you guys. Bye.